Howdy, y'all. My name is Prez. I'm coming at you with some more Be Happy. We're back in Be Happy. How's it going, y'all? And uh, this is the pig pen. Still looking roughly the same as it did last time. I actually didn't get as much done as I wanted to in between, mostly just because the stuff I was doing um, is taking a lot of time. I'd like to get this smelter up and running so that we can actually be building some better gear, because I'd like to really get geared up. I think it'd be pretty cool. Uh, and as I was thinking about getting geared up, I remembered something that people were telling me about in uh, Shattered Skies, which is... Do -do 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 -do. Manulian ore, which you can actually get a Manulian princess. I didn't realize that. Ardite and Cobalt, that makes sense. Um, so, uh, these are the two bees that I would need to make in order to get Ardite and Cobalt. And then I can get, apparently, a straight Manulian drone as well. So that's really cool. I wonder if I can also get an Enderium bee. I bet I can, huh? No, you can't! Uh, Ender bee? Ender bee, maybe? Let's see, let's see. Alright, let's check this. Let's check, um... Are there Ender Enderium Nuggets, right? Because if there's Nuggets, we could probably get a bee from one of these, right? Aha! An Endearing Queen. Where do you come from? Winsome and Carbon. Well, Carbon we need to make. Uh, anyways, and a Winsome Princess is from Platinum and Oblivion. We need Platinum. We need to make a Platinum. Uh, and an Oblivion Drone comes from... Must be a Hive Bee? So it might be a magical one that I'm going to have to look into getting. Oh, no! It's right there. Oblivion Bee. Okay, what do I need for that? Honey, stringy, mundane, got those. Embittered, we need simmering, and infernal, we need mundane. So this infernal, we're gonna need to use, I'm gonna need to be getting some of these simmering comes. So I need to actually, well, it's about to come nighttime. So we'll deal with that. I need to go into the nether really quick. I need to grab my uh, bees that are in the nether that I never grabbed back out of the nether. Um, and then from there, I can bring those back and we can mess with those. Um, but the overall goal for today, I'm continuing to work through the um, colored honey. I'll show you the progress I've made. I've cleared red, yellow, blue, green, orange, and white. Uh, and so I'm working on the rest of these. Oh, and purple and brown. So I can actually show you those bees and the um, the changes that I've made. Oh, I left my jetpack uh, up inside the pig pen to accommodate. We got a lot of, or not the pig pen, in the storage container. Um, got a lot of stuff to uh, have. Um, Java barrels for and whatnot now with all these different bees and we're gonna be getting even more um, So uh, here we have our different colored combs that are coming in I don't have one for brown or white up on here yet those guys. I'm still processing through uh, in here And I'm actually you'll see I'm working on making an extra red Queen which oh man, I let it go auto for too long. That's too bad uh, White Queen let's turn you off auto as well because I need you to be a white queen So these guys I'm just trying to run through them so that they will give me um what you call them. They will give me those specific queens so that I can breed with them. Uh, and then from there, I will um, mess with them breeding-wise. But uh, for this episode, I'm going to leave that off uh, for now so that we don't have to worry too much about it. Here you can see I made a cool little setup here. Uh, Java barrel goes into the centrifuge. Centrifuge processes what's in there. What comes out of that goes into this chest here. So I've been making a ton of those silky wisps so that we can make more of that silky uh, mesh so we can actually make the apiarist outfit. Um, you'll notice I'm getting some effect over here. I put the Imperial Queens into the system finally, so there's a spot for Royal Jelly up in there now, and uh, the combs are getting put in there, so that's cool. Uh, and this also gives us the regeneration buff, uh, which is going to be part of our, um, what you call it? It's going to be part of our... Uh, our spa. So this is one of the effects that we'll have. You go in there, you get a nice little refreshment. Okay. Um, we've got, oh, this thing I had hooked up. I can just put, uh, honey drops into here. They go into the, let's get to an angle where you can see it. The squeezer. Squeezer automatically pumps out into here. So we have 75,000 millibuckets of honey. It's a ton of honey. I'd like to fill this thing up. Actually, I was kind of mad to find out that the colored honeys, you can't actually squeeze. Um, they just basically are used like dyes, but it's nice that we now have dyes essentially. But, um, I was hoping that I could make a whole bunch of different tubes of different colored, um, honeys. But I can do that with liquid metals as well. So we'll do that at some point just for like some cool design stuff. Um, let's look through here. What do we got? What do we got? Uh, these are all the nuggets and things. Here's the royal jelly. You can see we've got a bunch of that in there. How much do we have? 11. That's amazing. 11 stacks. That's a ton of royal jelly. Um, bees obviously down at the bottom. Tons of different, uh, combs up in here. And then I decided we're gonna have, uh, all the colored dyes, um, or rather the, um, colored honey drops in here. And this is sort of gonna be like a painting room. I'm gonna see if I can get, um, 
the uh, deco craft added to this mod pack if I can, because uh, it's not currently in here. Uh, I checked last time, and unless they've updated the mod pack, uh, I don't think it's in. Yeah. So uh, I'd like to see if I can add it to the mod pack just for the purpose of just adding things like painters easels and stuff, because I think it'd be really cool to have like a painting room or like a design room, you know? Um, and so this will be for certain things I have to do with painting. And then we'll do the same thing with each of these other rooms to turn them into kind of like special crafty rooms. So it's like, here's where all the ingredients are. Here's where all the fun crafting does. There's where all the machinery is, etc., etc. Okay, so that's future plans. Anyway, just wanted to show you the stuff that's been added into here. So let's look at the, the bees and things that we um, need to be dealing with for the quests that we want to do, right? Because this is the quest line I said I wanted to go down. The Sky Stone, then the Silicon, then the Certus Quartz, and then finally the Fluix line. I wanted to go down that. I also need to get the Carbon Bee because we could use Coal. Um, and then this is something that we'll need to do as we start to work towards the machines and things. But this is kind of the path that we're on right now. Let me go get those bees out of the nether um, so that I can work with uh, making them into usable bees that won't murder us uh, over here. Oh, I also, the, the big thing and why things were taking me so long was I was doing that breeding of the bees um, in order to get the different colored bees and the um, trying to get the specific gene for the faster. And uh, I finally got it. It took forever. So do you make the right kind of combs? You make molten combs, actually. You're spiteful. So I need to figure out which one of y'all makes simmering combs. And maybe it's the... Um, Maybe it is the infernal bee, the one that we're gonna get as a hive bee. So, uh, well, that's cool. We'll get these guys all genetified up so that they can be into the system as well because I think that that'll be useful to be getting these molten combs. I'm sure they're useful. Um, oh, for one of the die bee quests, we got another power cell. We got this redstone energy cell here. So that's really cool because that means that it is, um, uh, gonna be storing more power for us. So that's we have 80 million I think on this guy and then we have another 20 million on this guy So, you know that that gave us a nice big boost to our um, Energy storage, which is definitely a nice thing We'll go ahead and throw this guy back on here just so it can charge up and then I'll also I'll keep it as a part of the system So it's charging in from the back and then it's Redistributing back down into there. So this is kind of like our battery setup. You know, this one's nowhere near as powerful, but still useful nonetheless um, Okay, so let's mess with our bees. I really got Gotta deal with some nonsense here. All right, got the red queen that I wanted, or red princess rather. Let's uh, drop the drones. Don't need any of y'all. This is just deleting them, by the way. When you have NEI and you have it set to, I think it's called cheat mode or something like that, um, it will delete things as they come out here. It also means if you click on something, it will um, give you a whole stack of it. So just, you know, scout's honor. I'm not doing that. Um, and if I ever, I have accidentally done it a couple times, and then I just, like, I immediately just delete them because, you know, I don't want to cheat my way through the mod pack. I actually want to generate all the stuff that I get. It makes it take longer, but, it's, you know, in my opinion, if you're not doing it um, that way, at least for me, it just doesn't really kind of... It doesn't track well for me. I just, uh, I, I like gaining the things on my own, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Okay, so there's all that stuff done. I basically I turned a common princess and a cultivated princess into these ones so that I can use them for um, breeding for the next set of dye bees. But we're gonna, I'm gonna leave that on uh, for me to do uh, offline because y'all have seen me work with those bees and you know that it's just mixing the different colors together and uh, it's no biggie. I would like to work on these newer different bees. So let's quickly get these um, spitefuls through here and I'll show you, look, if you look at this, it's speed faster now. Effect none, fertility four, flowers. Ooh, you know what we're gonna need though? Is we're gonna need to change the environment for these guys as well, because they're a nether environment bee. So that might be something that I also have to wait for later, unless I have some bees for that. Territory average, flowers, flowers, species majestic, territory average, um, flowers, flowers, lifespan. I believe that territory is not environment. Um, but let me check, actually, if we look at what the genes are called. Territory missing uh, is a thing. Cave dwelling, flowering. Temperature tolerance, I think, is something that we want. Um, maybe that is. Maybe territory average. Let's add that in there. And let's just see what happens. Because um, I am going to have to mess with some of these bees anyway. Well, here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. Let's look at this bee. Let's look at his genes. Long lifespan, normal production, slowest, flower type, nether, fertility, 2x, territory. See, territory is larger, so that just means the area that they affect, I think. The effect is N, so that I can get rid of, but it's the environmental stuff. Hellish climate is what I need to deal with. So is there a um, climate control? Like, I remember this thing is used in the, um, the 
other types of things. What about emulation? Nether emulation upgrade, that's what I want. Uh, hell emulation upgrade, so that needs blaze powder and stuff like that. We might have one though from that quest that we can repeat. Uh, I think that's in a box like way over on the other side. So I need to go and actually grab all those and bring them over here. I'm gonna go check uh, for those guys. Because if I can emulate that, then no biggie, and then we'll run those guys through just so we can get some more different combs into the system. Oh, cool. Hell emulation. Oh, what do we got here? Got some infernal drones and a hateful drone. Okay. Are those... Is hateful what I need? No, hateful's not what I need. Hateful, keep in here. Infernal drone. Let's see. Uses is... Doot, doot. Uh, no. I want to see... All right, hold on. Here's what I want to look at. Infernal. And use. What do you produce? What do you produce? Molten combs. All right, so then we're gonna get these simmering combs. I thought it was from them. Okay, uh, recipe comes from embittered, furious, volcanic, transmute. What is this guy? I want that guy. Look at these guys, transmuting, fiendish, and sinister, and demonic. What is that? Glowstone? Ooh, that could be good. That could be really good. Demonic, where do you come from? Sinister and fiendish. Sinister comes from embittered and cultivated. All right, so this is a long line of bees. We're going to have to go to these nether bees. So we're going to... Hmm, I'm going to take these guys back. We're going to put them away, and I'm going to keep that in mind for later. We're going to work on those skystone bees, because I know that's the one that I had said that I would work on, and it's not like... Uh, crucial that I worry about that stuff yet, so no worries. Uh, let's also look at that bee backpack, just so I can. Uh, apiarist, apiarist, backpack. And we can also make this awesome apiary stuff, so that's be cool too. Wool, string, sticks, apiarist chest. Apiarist chest is easy. Let's go grab, um, see how much wool we have left. We don't have a lot, so I do need to get those spidery bees as well. God, there's so many bees that I need to be getting. It's ridiculous. Okay, uh, wool, one, two, and we got some string. One, two, three, four. And we need some sticks. One, two, I believe that was it. Plus an apiarist chest, which is a chest with some glass, one, two, three, I believe, and a uh, bunch of honeycombs, which I happen to have on me. So, chest, honeycombs, uh, glass, is that right? No, it's not, okay, what are you then? Oh, it's one glass, one glass in the center. There we go, boom, apiarist chest. Uh, was it sticks, wool, and string, like that. Boom, got it, apiarist backpack. So, check this out. Right click that, five pages. It's the same size as the, um, what you call it, as the apiarist chest itself, which is rad. And now I can take all these bees, and we're just gonna drop them on the ground. Can I? There we go. There we go, just like this. Watch this, just do this. Boop, 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 boop. And then watch this. Guess where it all went? Guess where they all went? Boom, right into there, perfect. So I'm just gonna quickly queue all these guys out of here. Uh, just to, oh, the ones that are in stacks, I just kinda gotta drop them. Q, 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 drop, drop. And I'll, I'll organize these later, but this way I'm just, I know that I'll be able to actually find all the bees that I'm looking for just by quickly scrolling through there. And I'll have it with me all the time, so I'll be able to like look and be like, which bees do I have? Which bees do I, don't I have? Um, so that'll be good. And yeah, okay, cool. So. Now we should have a nearly full, oh no, it's got plenty of pages left, cool. Uh, and let's put you guys in there as well. Oh no, threw those guys too far, almost way too far. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's go sleep and then let's also Skystone B's quest. Let's check this out. Uh, machinery, uh, Skystone, we need what are called Skystone princesses. How do we get them? Boop, 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 Skystone princess. What's your name? How are you dressed? All right, we need earthen princess and windy drones. These are different. Windy. Supernatural and ethereal. Oh, this is a long line, y'all. This is a long line. Okay. All right. Got to get out the uh, got to get out the note sheets here. Time to make a big long list of notes. This may be something that's going to take us a little longer than I expected. I thought that like usually these quests they have like because they're built off of previous quests, they take some time. Okay. So, we start with the Skystone, which is our goal. That comes from, do 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 do. That comes from an earthen, do 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 do, which is made up of supernatural and ethereal, do 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 supernat. 
and ethereal. I swear, like, at the end of Be Happy or sometime soon when I have a little bit of extra time, which I might around the corner, uh, I'm totally going to make a huge guide for how to do all this kind of stuff because I feel like a lot of this is more confusing than it needs to be. All right. Uh, wait, which one is that? This is for the supernatural. We get charmed and enchanted. I think we're getting closer to stuff that I can actually get. Charmed and enchanted. Okay, and then the charmed comes from cultivated and eldritch. Got both of those. Easy peasy. I can buy the cultivated and then I can, um, I have plenty of uh, eldritch drones that we built up because remember I was trying to build up a whole bunch of them for this purpose. Uh, okay, so then back to the sky stone. Um, which is the, let's see, I need to know what the enchanted bee is actually. Boop, 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 boop. Enchanted. Recipe is Eldritch and Charmed. So this is, so then we go like these two over here. So it's one of those like kind of looping um, systems where it's like you build the one and then you take that drone and give it to another one in order to get the next one. Okay, so we know how to make the supernatural now. Okay, so then the next bee we need to make is the ethereal. Man, this is such a long line because all this is just for the earthen as well. All right, Ethereal Queen comes from Arcane and Supernatural. Okay, so Supernat cycles over to Ethereal, and then the other one is what's called a Arcane Princess. Now, where do we get the Arcane? Comes from Esoteric and Mysterious. Oh my gosh, you guys, we're gonna have so many bees at the end of this. Um, but luckily, once we have them, uh, it's a lot easier to make more of them. I actually, another thing that I want to do eventually, and this is part, um, one reason, I'll actually show you. Um, one of the reasons for this whole place, the whole stocking up of almost every type of drone, is not only does this allow me to have drones so that I can force bees into becoming this species, if I run enough of them through, and I've already started collecting a couple of these genes, you actually get a gene for species, and then I can make genetic templates for literally every species of bee. And then it no longer becomes a concern of being able to breed the bees properly. If you have the genes, you can just create that bee out of nothing. Um, or, you know, just I can take common, cultivated, forest, whatever drones, and just turn them into those bees. Um, okay, so we need to figure out what those esoteric and mysterious bees are all about. My goodness, y'all. Oh, oh, there's a creeper. There's a creeper on the loose. Time to flip and die. I have to go find my sword. And then I'll kill that guy. I guess he burned up because he's no longer alive. He's not on the map. He's dead. Hooray! Thank you. That was my song, uh, Murder is a Creeper. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it'll be available on iTunes shortly. That's a lie. It won't be. Okay. Um, so, Esoteric and Mysterious B. In case you are, like, confused as to, like, what I was doing there about that uh, creeper thing, if you go back and look at the map, there was a creeper on the map shortly. Um, cultivated and Eldritch. Okay. So, that leads to the Esoteric. So, that's easy. Cultivated and Eldritch. We actually already are going to have to be doing that a bunch. So we're going to need to make a bunch of these Cultivated um, cultivated and Eldritch. It's going to be a lot of them, actually. I should have a bunch of drones, which means I just need a bunch of uh, Cultivated Queens uh, or Princesses. All right, uh, so that makes it Esoteric. And the other one is what's called a Mysterious Bee. Mysterious. Okay. And what is that? Eldritch and Esoteric. So Esoteric loops on over there. And Eldritch. Okay. So that makes a little bit more sense. And then we have the, what was the other one that the Sky Stone comes from? This is, these are so many bees. I probably just spent the last five minutes just talking about the bees that we're gonna have to get. And I realized that it's already 20 minutes into the episode. Oh my gosh, Windy Drone, which is probably Earth and plus something, I bet. Supernatural plus Ethereal. Okay, so Supernatural and Ethereal. They Oh, so it's the same one. So they both make Earthen and Windy. So we're gonna have to make double of each of these basically. But uh, that's actually not really a huge deal. Uh, okay. So, let's get started on this. Let's at least start setting the groundwork for a couple of these bees. And let me just quickly look at the, um, the silicone one as well. What do you require? Skystone plus Ferris. Easy to do once we have that. No problem. We can easily do that one. Okay, then let's look at the quest again as well for Certus Quartz. Is uh, silicon and Skystone. Easily done. And then is the Fluix just going to be the same? The next in the line. Recipe. 
Certus and Skyzone. All right, cool. So once we start this chain, it takes some time, but it eventually gets us right to there. So that's great. Um, so that should be new probs whatsoever. So let's uh, go grab a bunch of honey. We are going to buy ourselves a cultivated princess. And if we can, we'll also buy an Eldritch, because I think you can buy Eldritch, right? I think this is something I go back and forth on every time. Either I'm, I always think you can't and you can, or I think you can and you can't. Uh, I do not see Eldritches. So, but I do remember I made a bunch of Eldritches for this purpose. So, all right, cultivated. Let me, um, we're going to get a bunch of honey, and we're going to just keep buying these as often as we can, because it's every couple minutes you can, really. Um, and they seem to be the basis for a lot of these. So, manual submit, claim reward. Cool. Now, I might actually have some left over. Let me look through our eight beers backpack. Uh, we have one cultivated. We have, oh, I need to cycle those guys through a bunch. Need more of those. We got 10 Valiant Drones, because remember I was trying to make a bunch of those again for this purpose. We have a bunch of Eldritch Drones that we can kill. Um, seems like that might be all, but that's still fine. So we have one cultivated already, and then we have the other cultivated we just made, so we can at least do two of those guys. So let's go ahead and do that. Do, 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 do. Wee! Do, 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 do. Hey, hey. Do, 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 do. Hey, hey. Cultivated and Eldritch, and we will get our Esoteric. Boop, 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 boop. We'll have to look at their stats really quickly to see what they do, and then we'll probably run them through the system, as we do. As we tend to do. Where's my second Cultivated? Here you go. So we'll also make the Charmed. So we now have an Esoteric and a... Uh, what is the other one that we just made? The Charmed. Okay, so that is... I'm just looking at my list right here. So we've got this guy right here. And then we're going to need to mix the Charmed with an Eldritch to get the end something, the end or something. Endearing, I think. I can't even see what it is, I, my chicken scratch handwriting. And then we need to mix the Esoteric with an Eldritch to get a Mysterious. So we're going to need to get some extra drones from each of these guys. So I'm going to run these guys through the system and get them starting to um, feed forward. But then we'll just go do something else really quickly just to um, kind of end the episode with uh, a little more stuff going on. Because I do feel sometimes like I, I uh, sort of... I get so caught up in all the bee stuff and all the breeding, and I know that not everybody is a huge fan of all that, but it is, like, the center of this mod pack, and it is my favorite part. I love this whole, like, genetic um, uh, messing with the, the genes in order to breed the new things. I, it might seem simple to some people, but I love it. All right, let's um, run you through. Let's run you through, and then we'll, we'll have to do the whole system with them so that we can get a bunch of them and blah, blah, blah. That's going to take some time. So let's look at some other things on our list of stuff to do that I'm sure that we can get to while we wait for those bees to become super bees. Um, bee backpack. We did it. Boom. Let's come here. Come here. Let's come here. There we go. All right. Uh, spot we're working on. Thoughtcraft, Britannia, nuclear power, computer system, elevators, food to the pig pen, skystone bee. We're working on that. More power, auto packager system, trash chest. Okay. This one, I still need to work on, but I'm taking it off of there because it's, uh, that's just implied with the pig bed now. Oh, I meant to show you guys this. Um, whoa. We were having so much stuff, so much throughput, that uh, it wasn't being able to get out of the chest fast enough. So I ended up making three more nodes coming off of our little buffer chest here. And now it's clearing out like a champ. Um, but yeah, that is going to be one downside of uh, the more we increase this and having it all go through a single line means that this buffer chest becomes even more and more... Um, God, it gets more stress on it, I guess. Let's look at some quests then. You know what we're going to do? We're going to finish this bee restaurant quest. We haven't done this yet. It's taken us forever. And then let's look at this some magic quest because we could get some armor right now is with this stuff. So how do I make this shield? I need floral green powder, which comes from a mortar and pestle and this. That's so easy. We can make that pink armor. Let's do it. Okay, so... Uh, Direwolf's bow tie? That's so cute! Oh my goodness. It might not be just that part of the quest, though. Like, it, it is one quest that could, like, go on forever. Who knows? Um, okay, but for this, uh, B restaurant, let us make some toast. So I need to make 32 toast. Do I have any wheat? Of course I don't have any wheat. I have seven toast, though. Um... I made a bunch of wheat into thatch earlier. Can I take it back out? I can. Perfect. So let us... It's like this? No, it's like three in a three in a thing. Yeah, that thatch thing was cool. I was looking at trying to look at um, blocks um, that were like unique and different that I'd never seen before, but the texture's not very great and it's a little simple. But I like the idea behind it of making basically like hay bales. Uh, all right, so I think what we have to do is we have to make a bunch of bread and then we cook that in our furnace, which is here, redstone furnace. And let's just do that real quick. And it should. 
pump right through there. Oh man, someone in my building is cooking something and it smells like fire again. I think it's just toast though. It smells like, it smells like toast. It worries me always every time they do that, but I know it's just people burning stuff. It's not an actual fire in my apartment. I literally just got back here. Um, okay. Let's see. So that's all coming through here. So that's good. Let's look at what the other one is that we're waiting on. Chocolate milk. I need to make a mortar and pestle. So how do I make you? Three colored stone, or just three stone, and a stick. So do I have any stone sitting up in here? Because I know I made some of you. I have a bunch more seared bricks, by the way, that I need to be using for um, uh, making more stuff for our smelter. Because I really do want to get that stuff done. But at least we can, like I said, finish this little part of the quests. Uh, real quick, let's just put some of these down. Uh, I can get those in just a second. I need to make some chests for those. And let's just burp. All right. Um, whang, and sticks. And you. And this. And oh, I only grabbed two. Why did I only grab two? Because uh, I'm awesome. That's why. Uh, <laughs> oh, and you know what else I can make? I can make the apiarist armor as well. So we'll do that too. We're going to make a whole bunch of stuff. See? It, le it looked like I wasn't going to do anything this entire time. And then it turns out I was going to do all the things. All right. Uh, mortar and pestle we got. So how do I, what do I do here? Cocoa powder. I need to make 16 cocoa powder, which I assume I take cocoa. Uh, and then I run it through the mortar and pestle. And that will probably give me cocoa powder. So let's go like this. Let's go like you. And we go like that. And we got 19 cocoa powder. Okay. And then quest. Now chocolate milk is... Uh, I need milk and I need cocoa powders. Do we have a milky bee that's making us milky stuff? I can't... I think we do, don't we? I don't know if I have them in the system, though. I had this Wheaton one going through here for forever, but I just realized I don't know if I have the milky one doing it. What are you? Nope. You. Argentum. Nope. I know I have one of you doing it somewhere, or you were for at least a little while. Maybe I took him out. Let's see. I think I did, actually. But I can go look at the uh, combs that we have on store. Yeah, because we should have a bunch of them stored up. I just don't know if we have enough. But at least we can get close to it, and that's an easy one for me to finish out. Yeah, I think I probably took them out at some point when we were working on the pig bees and the bovine bees. Um, let's look at the combs. Uh, what do we got? Powdery comb. No. Milky combs. Awesome. All right, here's what we're going to do. We are going to quickly woo, throw these guys into nya. Boop, boop. Shwa, 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 shwa. Okay, so now you'll see they're going into the centrifuge. Let us see. Oh, I wonder. Let me see something real quick. Use recipe. I know that the socket things, you can get upgrades. Uh, so centrifuge, it is forestry. So at forestry. And let's look for upgrades really quickly. Uh, I love how NEI does this now, where it like pulls the things away from there. That's really great. They'll look really silly. They'll look like just little flat deals that like, would fit in that slot, I believe. Do, 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 uh, nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Um, and the, other, the reason I say they look silly is because they uh, this part of the mod pack hasn't been updated. Oh, I guess not. I'll have to look into it then. It's these little chips that you can put in there to upgrade them. Um, okay, so that's us processing through. How much uh, milky drops do we have? Okay. And then I'm going to need that to get pumped into here. And how many... Oh my gosh, how much milk do we need? I think we need a lot, actually. Now that I think about it. Uh, chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. It needs... A soy milk will work, a milk bottle will work, a milk bucket will work. Fresh milk will work. Cool. So that means you can turn one uh, milk bucket into four. So that's uh, that's not that bad. Okay. Let's let you guys, we'll let you guys process through. Let's go take another nap real quick. Again, I'm letting this get longer. It's so funny. I, on days where I don't have enough time to play, what ends up happening is, because like, so today, just full disclosure, it's Saturday when I'm recording this. Uh, and so we had our regular local recording day, which takes a long time. We go over to Ash and Jasmine's, we record a bunch, then I have to get home, it takes me a while. Uh, but also today we did our uh, seventh day of Stump Miss? I think it was the seventh day. So it was our, our streaming thing where we all streamed together. It was a ton of fun, we had a great stream, but that also meant it tacked on an extra several hours to our um, usual time. So what that meant, is uh, that uh, I got home late, didn't have a ton of time to do this, I didn't have a lot of time to do prep, so the only prep that I had was the stuff that I'd already... Oh, this is bad. Oh, it's in here. Oh, no. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Stop. Stop. I need you to stop. Okay. Stay in here, thanks. Okay. Milk going in there now. Milk do you... Oh, you, each one gives you two. That's great. Um, milk do you... All right. I, uh, I'll put the rest of these in here. Uh, and then I'll go build our, let's build our woven silk dealie. You done? Oh, you need more water. You need more water. Boop, 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 boop. Nope, not you. 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 
Let's just keep filling this up. No, nope, not like that. Keep filling this up a little bit until it's full. Oh, no, you don't. Are you kidding? How did that happen? How? All right, you. Like this. I could have sworn I grabbed from the middle. Boop. Okay. Middle. To you. And middle. To you. Middle. You. Middle. You. Middle. You. Okay, that should be enough for right now. Uh, did I grab that stuff? No, it's right there. Right here. 21. Okay, so that should be enough to build the whole thing close to it, maybe. All right, let's build the hat. Boop. Let's build the chest. Boop. Let's build the pantalones. Boop. And then we need three more. Doop doop doop. Do 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 do. Hey, almost made the perfect amount. Just a little bit too much. Uh, boop boop. All right, we got this. Let's put it on. Let's look fancy. Uh, we're not gonna be able to wear it all the time because we obviously need our um, jetpack on. But we can at least wear parts of it because it's super cute. Uh, Lair helmet. <laughs> look at us! Look at us! Look at us! Look at us! Look at us. Yeah! I am the bee man. No bees can hurt me. I am the super bee pig. But even in here, you can't tell that I'm a pig. I move amongst the bees as if I am one of them. They see me as the ultimate bee. I am Pig Bee, the destroyer. Uh, that got dark. Oh, wow, that, uh... Wow, something really came over me. I gotta be careful with this, uh... With this suit on, I think uh, with with great power comes great responsibility. Uh, but I'll, for now, I'll leave the uh, rest of this on, but we'll have our jetpack. Uh, all right, let's put you away, put you away. And where is this? We'll put that away. Uh, so we should be set. Okay, cool. And, oh, we don't have our little glasses on anymore. But we don't need them on right now. That's fine. We'll be wearing this thing for a little bit. Makes us a little bit different. Um, okay, Milk Dude, how are you doing? 3,000. Cool, so I do this. Boom, get a milk bucket, and then watch this. I go like this, go like this. Boom, fresh milk, so we got four. So we're gonna do that a couple times. I think I need to put a couple more milky drops through here, which is vain. We got tons. Uh, boop. Okay, and let's look at the quests. Uh, oh, let's grab our toast. We can finish the toast part, or the first part of the toast part, because we don't know if that's the only part. Uh, where is this quest book? Okay, uh, back this. Uh, claim reward. We're gonna get a block wrestle. We're gonna get this. Uh, let's get um, production upgrades. I've been getting tons of lifespan upgrades recently, so we should be good on those. Chocolate milk. We're working on. I just need the actual milk itself. So milk bucket. Boom, boom. This, that, boom. Eight. I need sixteen total, I believe. Grab you. Boom. Why is this stuff not going through again? You should be. Go oh, because I got rid of the. Um... No, it should still be going through, but that's fine. I'll uh, I'll just put it in manually. Squeezer. Boop. Okay, got you, got you, got you. It might be because I took out the um, uh, transfer note, but this should be because there's a there's an actual transfer. Oh, I accidentally put my pick in there. That's why. Ah, it's funny. All right. Uh, okay. Boom. Grab you. Give me that. Boom. 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 Got it. Okay. Uh, let's put away some stuff. Cause I got too much stuff. This is my trash chest, but it is not a trash chest. Oh, and you know what I should do? I should also do because we probably have enough time. Store. Open. Need another one of you. Uh, manual. Oh, not done. Give me back. Oh, come here. Give me back. Give me back that. I wasn't done. I was lying. I was kidding. Boom. Gotcha. Boom. Got it. Okay, cool. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Um. Now, quest. Boom. Boom. Uh, we go to the uh, the old bee restaurant here. We go to the old uh, chocolate milk here. Okay, gotta make the chocolate milk. Okay, here's what we do. We go, uh, we take it as fresh milk. We take it as a cocoa powder. Boom, chocolate milk. How much healing does that do, you think? Ooh, that's a lot. It's even better than um, carrot juice. We're going to be drinking chocolate milk for a little bit here, y'all. Uh, oh, but wait. We're probably going to have to turn it in, aren't we? Lame. Don't make me waste my chocolate milk. Uh, we'll take a lifespan upgrade for this one. All right, cool. Didn't make me waste it. Awesome. Lunch. Uh, I need to make a toast sandwich, which is two pieces of toast. How many toast sandwiches do I need to make? 16, which I think just means, yeah, we do that. Easy. Uh, okay, and then we go like, why did you? Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Why did this stack? <laughs> That's silly. Um, and we'll get five cultivators and five commons. And we want industrial apiaries. Don't have enough space. Dude, that's a ton. That is a ton. I need so much space in order to have all those guys, but that's amazing. Let's just get rid of like everything out of here right now. Uh, okay, 
Should be good, should be good. I know that all my stuff is in here now, but geez, Louise. Give me these. Three more of those plus all of those queens. Oh, you guys. Q, 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 Gimme. Yeah, and then I actually kind of want to do that for you as well. Thank you. Okay, let's go look at these guys. How are they doing on their little quest to be awesome? Looks like these guys ended up perfect the first time through. These guys let us do this. I actually don't know for a fact that they ended up perfectly, but uh, it's fine. Uh, and then we'll grab you, we'll grab you, and we'll, we'll mess with it again in a second, just double check them. But uh, them having the same things over and over again is a good sign. Occult combs and these combs. Alright, we'll let them cycle through. I'll do that all offline. We finished our uh, awesome apiarist outfit. We finished our awesome apiarist backpack. We finished our toast quest. Uh, I think that's a pretty good set of stuff we did. We're working down that line uh, for the Skystone Bees, which I may do some of offline, because again, y'all know my strategy. I like to run the bees through so that I get a nice little catalog. I expand out my stuff and everything. I don't want to push you guys through all of that. So I think the goal for next time is going to, I'll have all that stuff done or nearly done so we can start getting Fluix Crystals. That's going to be great because then we can start working on the MFE. Or is that what it's called? I think it's called that. It's something like that. The, the giant computer system. And then I also want to at least be making headway on getting those Manulian bees. Manulian? Hold on. I always, let's see. Manulian. Man, Manulian. I don't, that's a word that to me doesn't look like a real word, like it's, um, <laughs> the syntax to it doesn't match a language that I'm familiar with, so many, many Uleon, many Uleon, something like that. Anyway, uh, so, let's, uh, I guess let's go ahead and we'll, we'll take it here, let's go quickly go fly over to our, um, big old sign over here and just look at this again, just so we, we kind of take our bearings here. Trash chest, spa, thomcraft, nuclear power, computer system, elevators, more power, skystone, bee path, fluix. All right, so one thing I want to add on to here. Oh, let's go grab. Eh. Eh, third person is weird. Third person is weird, but it's also kind of cool, but it's also kind of weird. Give me this. I wanted uh, signs. Okay. Put a couple things on here that are going to help us understand what we need to be doing here. All right, we need do do do, do back to uh, F5 F5. We need to make the uh, spidery princess. So I had spidery princes, spidery princess, uh, in order to start getting some um, wool. And then we also need hold on boop boop simmering combs because we're gonna need those for some infernal bees that we need so that we can start getting those different nether ore bees uh, for the manu, manu um, And the spidery princess, let's just quickly look at the spidery, spidery princess, because it's got a couple of things that we're gonna really want. Spidery princess recipe. Uh, it is this one here. It comes from these tropical and skulking ones, which are um, the skulking one. I think we might have one. I think uh, we got one before because we needed it for some breeding, but um, the use is, are, do, 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 produces string and spider's eyes. So this will be getting us some of those deals. And so this is kind of like the, um, it is the mob item tree. And so we'll be able to get string and then we can get wool and then with that wool and then if we get an ender bee or th that endearing bee maybe even, uh, we can uh, start making the elevator so we can go up and down through our system much more easily. I would like to be having bees to be able to do that. I don't want to waste, or I mean, it's not so much wasting, but we don't have a lot of wool. And so I don't want to rely on that for doing all of that stuff. Anyway, this has been a super long episode. This is what you get, man. This is what you get when I have a long, when I have a long day, you get a longer episode for some reason because I can't plan ahead. Oh boy. Boy. Well, we got tons of stuff going on though, right? So um, by next time, I should have all the color bees done. I should have the um, Skystone path pretty well along its way, at least to the Skystone bee itself, and then the stuff that we'll need in order to breed those other bees. Um, but yeah, I think uh, with all that, uh, we got these cool new little setups for our machines over here, and I know I still haven't moved this stuff into the pig pen. Uh, be patient. It will happen soon. Like I said, just waiting on getting some more solar panels so I feel a little bit more comfortable about our energy situation, and wait until we get some more of these flux ducts. And so if I'm going to be going down these uh, machinery paths, then I should uh, be able to get some stuff soon. And if not, uh, once we get at Endearing B, that's going to allow us to make the flux ducts do 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 what we want to be able to make are these guys these resonant flux ducts which need endirium redstone and redstone energy flux ducts which need 
uh, destabilize myself, blah, 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 all this kind of stuff. Anyway, long story short, this is all doable. We just need to be getting that in Deerium. So that'll be kind of like the end there. So, uh, ooh, look at that. Isn't that fancy looking? Oh, that might be a thumbnail for how silly it looks. Yes, look into the eyes of Pigby the Destroyer. The one who rules the bees. The one who lives with the bees. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Whenever I put that mask on, I get like all kind of power hungry and crazy. It's weird, man. I gotta be careful with that. Anyway, uh, with all that, thank you all for watching. If you like yourself, please be sure to give this video a like, a favorite, and subscribe to the channel. My name has been Price. And my name has been Pigby the Destroyer. And I'll see y'all next time.